Hello and welcome to Let's Play Dishonored. The bear, the bear, the bear. You're it messing again. it up. The bear, stop. You're messing it up. You don't have screen share on. I'm gonna keep this in there. You're it's fine. That's fine. But put screen share on. I have. Okay. Stop <laughs> whining. That's, you're already messing up, Sapair. You're going. You're it's going not to die. If you don't mess up. And I'm going to laugh you. I'm, I'm actually. Laugh you. Uh, we are playing very hard because that's how I play. I'm, yeah, I, I play very. I, I play very hard all the time. Of of course you do. We're gonna. We're just gonna start up. You're gonna see a guy, and you're gonna immediately just die when he looks at you. I'm sure it's gonna happen. Returning I don't know why home. I'm being such a dick today. You have just but darn returned. it, Sapair, you're going to die. You have just returned from a journey of several months, visiting the other nations in the Empire to ask for aid in dealing with the Red Plague. You must now deliver the diplomatic response to the Empress, whom you serve as Lord Protector. Lord Protector, Ma Lord Protector Mac Douchebag, to be exact. I'll deliver that diplomatic... Uh, what is it again? Response. I'll deliver that diplomatic response, so good girl. <laughs> I'm sure people will be upset. Anyway, before I go further, because now I actually know that there's gonna be cutscene the moment I click this button. Green Bean mm -hmm. has not played this game, though he knows this game. I have played about 35 minutes of this game. Which will be very slow 35 minutes, so in this let's play, because I am going to find every single secret I can find, and I'm gonna read all the books. And that's yeah. gonna take pretty much an hour because the game starts off with just swing so many books at you. Oh yeah! By the way, Sapir, remember my half-hour recording rule. Try to keep them around the half-hour mark. I I know this will be in the video. It's fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna probably gonna cut them that way. Okay, let's start. There's gonna be a cutscene and then more talking. And for those guys who do not know this game, it's a Stacy Stabby game with a lot. I would say I don't actually know what it's a lot like. I would say I guess it's like playing Dark Messiah if you decide to play it Stacy. It would never work really well, but whatever. It's not very much like Sieve, though it's inspired a bit by Sieve. Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain here. But there is no one else. And the spy master was right to insist oh, that I send Corvo. you. Oh, I want your dick. This is highly inappropriate. The plague has taken so many. Your face is highly control. inappropriate. When you are near, I'm glad I have some my heart is at peace. Yeah, I'm also glad you have subtitles because I'm reading this and return. I'm also just gonna be dick Hurry all the cutscenes. And bring good news. But yeah, as, as, as I told Green before we started this recording, I do feel this intro is very not that intro, but the intro that's now about to happen is very reminiscent of. Dark Messiah. Yeah, Dark Messiah might be magic. Um, Which is still one of my favorite games. Yeah, I totally just want to go back, and one of these days I'm just going to go back and find one of the old might and magic games and play the hell out of it. Because might and magic's great. Not Heroes Might and Magic. Heroes Might and Magic's okay if you're into that type of game. I'm not. But, um, you know. Hey, Sapir, are you into the, um, Heroes of Light Magic games? I've played one of them. I'm much more a fan of the Cyphers, which it was like, pretty much a concurrence, but it died like 10 years ago. Not mentioning the Cyphers 3, which sucked. But yeah, I say it's reminiscent of, um, Dark Messiah just because in Dark Messiah you start on a horse and you can't move. Now you start on yeah. a boat and you can't move. Really move yeah. through the times. So I guess it's not quite yeah, as actiony. I, I guess not, but either way, nah. from what I'm, it's a pair you forgot to turn your Skype off. Do no. it, Philly. Turn your Skype off. Turn it off. The Skype forgot to turn off itself. Skype. No. Skype. Admittedly, really, I do feel like this is not the best way to do this. Like, imagine there's a water fell on the boat and you like start sinking. It's like fuck. Yeah, that. This is a pretty great way to start a game. Um, and. Yeah, I, I'm really liking this. I, I, that's one of the things I definitely, and there are quite a few things to mention that are more likable about Dark Messiah than, um, besides besides the open world bit, um, Dark Messiah is in ways better than. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> what happened? 
I jumped on his head and that was a criminal offense. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Oh, See? Yeah, did... this is what I did. <laughs> yeah, you just literally... <laughs> 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 Mario, he fucking dies. That is fucking great and stupid. Uh, uh, I don't even know. That's just ridiculous. For oh, yeah, those watching, I am going to this, try to play this here. This is hilarious, but turn your Skype off. I'm serious. Do it. Do it. I, I turn gonna, it off. You, people are gonna hate your guts. I use my laptop. What? I use my laptop that? to turn it off. You didn't? Know what to do you didn't? Wait, what? I used yeah, my laptop to turn off the Skype. That's why I didn't see it. Low. Okay. They're touching, bro. They're touching. <laughs> oh yeah. I I love that touching. You can totally just grab that engineer's ass. I was like, good work, guy. This, cause clearly that's what engineers do. They're like football players. When before they win a game and after they win a game. Uh, well, before they play a game and after they win a game, they're all just like groping each other's asses. Fair voyage, sir. I've never understood. <clears throat> I've never understood why football players do that, because football players, some of them seem like you know, like the obviously high school football players Hello, seem like really homophobic type people. I'm not saying all, but it's uh, homophobic football players because they are. I mean, hom but that's why they're homophobic, because they are homos. <laughs> the sad thing is that this probably somewhere too. As, no, anyway, I, I, I wanna say before we go on a rant here, I am going to, before those who have seen me just jump on somebody's head and kill him, I am trying to play this game seriously. Wow, you're back. Don't, don't try and play it seriously, that's... <laughs> I, no, I have not yet played the game, I, I, I actually really, really wanted to play this game. Okay, well, I'm going to try my best to let you take it seriously, but that's... Uh, and then there's a little girl. Anyways, um, I'm gonna try my best to let you take it somewhat seriously, but I'm me. So, oh, hey, cool, multiple choice convers... I fucking love multiple choice conversations. There's not gonna be too many of them in this game, but at least there, there are a few. I From the, like, hour, 35 minutes that I played, there were, like, a few. There's just more. Do you want to do an intro or do you not want to do the intro? And as I had to do the intro so people can see it. But yeah, I, I'm gonna try to play yeah. somewhat seriously, but I know the first bit of the game, so I'm gonna be a bit silly in that part. Yeah, well that's fine. And you you're probably gonna have to rely to on... Sorry. Yeah, see what you can... see if you can jump on that little girl's head. I'm probably gonna... the game's gonna get very mad if I do that. <laughs> Even though I really, really, I really, really want to do that now. <laughs> do it! Do it! <laughs> Fucking do it! I want to see if the game is uh, like, oh, you I can't. Up. Oh, you can't. I, 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 I can make a joke, but then people are gonna get really mad and TK me, so I'm not going to. I, I don't know. You probably, it's probably gonna be a joke about fucking little girls, so <laughs> you're probably right. Um, anyways, uh, for soon. one, it's pretty. I, I also like this whole like tutorial. Um. From the looks of it, it's kind of reminding me of, uh, not exactly, because it's obviously a little more, um, it, it's a little more into what you're doing in the game, um, but this tutorial kind of reminds me of the Heavy Rain kind of tutorial. There are a few others like it, but, um, okay, like Heavy way. Rain, literally how ha. Heavy Rain's, huh? I I am better at hiding than a little guy. Oh my god, I'm awesome. <laughs> this is oh yeah, this is America. Fuck you, yeah, bitch! I can jump on your head. I, I <laughs> tea bag you, bitch. <laughs> oh, uh, one one second, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, as I was gonna say, which I can say no. Uh, you probably gonna have to rely on subtitles. I do not think I can get green bean or myself to shut up in the right moment. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. Alright, sorry about that. Back. Um <laughs> So y'all probably just heard my grandpa knocking on my door. I got some family stuff to do. Uh no big deal. So there's this dude painting this dude. Um so that's pretty cool, I guess. <laughs> We really have to oh, decide yeah. though if we wanna talk to him, because not so sure that there's a lot of talk in the first part, but I think we should try not to talk to him, like talking yeah. in cutscenes just uh, because there, 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 the voice acting is actually really good from what I like. From what uh, I saw. Yeah, it, oh. it, it looks like it's pretty good. I guess I can try to not talk, but I suppose I can paint 
I don't know. I've done that before, and the only problem with that, and we're probably going to do it later on anyways, um, but the problem with not talk, trying to not talk, is if, if you overdo it, it can make a Let's Play bad. You've already beaten this part, so I say, as far as the hardcore entry stuff goes, we go ahead and talk. When we get past the intro and you're actually doing stuff besides talking, um, sure, we, we can totally, but I'm you know. totally awesome. Oh yeah, America, you're on that guy's painting. Jump on someone's head! <laughs> The game's gonna get mad points. if I do. I know, the game will get mad. It's it's amazing. It's Look like at it, I want that casa. Imagine living in that. I know, that, that would be ball amazing. Ball. Oh god, I would have Grab that ass. There's a maid there! Oh yes, maids! No, look at the maid. Fine, look at the cutscene. Oh hey, sweet, that's the, the queen. Right? All of them. Yes. It's talking to. I guess I should have been able to tell from the cutscene. I was just making sure. Um, and yeah. They're, they're, they're talking. And the queen. Uh, I don't know. What do you think of the queen so far? Is is she. Does she sound cool? Does she sound like a, like a woman? I don't know why huh? my game decided to pause. Full of surprises. <laughs> As usual. I don't know either. Hmm. I do not like that guy. I, I, I know this might just be too much of a foreshadowing, but am I the? I, I, this is totally out of place, but I always feel like this guy looks a lot. <laughs> you know, like when you I know see this guy, actually, I feel like he's nuts. <laughs> you know what? Actually, I, I couldn't hear his voice acting, which is one of the few times where it's unfortunate. But did he sound evil? Because what he just he said. He sounds evil. Uh, he looks evil. He's the uh, most evil motherfucker uh, ever. Yeah, he, he probably is, because that line sounded re really evil. Two days early. Full of surprises as usual. It really is. The sad thing is, it's why. I've not actually played that game that far, but. It's not spoiling much. The guy is evil from what you know up to this point. But then again, in Dark Messiah, they managed to keep the evil guy, the evil guy, to like the very last minute. Like, only after you kill him, you really ever understand that he's not the evil guy. Oh. The necromancer guy, like he's actually a good guy, but the game yeah, never so outright tells yeah, you. They're they're basically they they do a really good job of being like, hey, big ass plot twist, and and you never see it coming. Which well, is I mean, good. I guess it's a beta because I don't know. I I think most people don't agree with me, but he wasn't really. I don't know. Did you, did you finish Dark Messiah? I unfortunately didn't. I really wanted to. I just but you know the necromancer guy, yes, the guy who fucked huh? you up all the time, the necromancer. Yeah. Yeah, and he like he's actually only debatably not really evil. He kinda tries to kill yeah, everyone. Go, but yeah, the only go, reason ta go talk to the Empress. We can we can talk about this while we talk to her. It's, it's fine, fine, like I said. Okay, what so anyways, that? I know I'm interrupting shit, so what you're saying. Um because if, I'm guessing you kinda know the basic steel of Dark Messiah where you are actually a demon and you're trying to you end up pretty much bringing back the demon lord. That's pretty much all the Necromancer has tried to do, save the world. He's kind of doing the whole sacrifice of you for the better of many. Like, he's not really that evil. So yeah. You are actually more of an evil character in that game, just not knowingly, than the Necromancer. Yeah, uh, I, I kind of get that, and it's one of those... And, and that's one of those definitely debatable things. Um, but yeah, I, I would say that's not that evil. Um, People, what? people who do Come things here. like sacrifice few for many are anywhere from neutral to good. Oh, hey, okay, combat! It. Assassins! Kill them! Kill them! Fight! Wow, these assassins suck good. <laughs> yeah, I know. What's <laughs> assassin? Kill them with all the violence! Shoot, shoot them! In the dick. And by shoot them in the dicks, Thank I mean you. shoot them in, in the face. Because that's more effective. No more. Not again. Oh no. Oh, dude's magic. Bitch. Oh, no. Oh, it's all terrible. Ow. Yep, I already know how this goes. It's all terrible. Find Emily. 
You could say she would finish. Haha! <laughs> totally! Wow. Too soon. <laughs> no. <laughs> Too soon, man. Too soon. Oh, and then. And then Nazi and guy shows up. Uh, uh, they're they're like, yes. why the fuck did you kill the queen? And I'm and like how he looks the one like, hey, hey, that's never gonna work, but I'm gonna make it work. Her own bodyguard. I run it. Bitch yeah. death. Oh, oh, poor guy getting bitch slapped. Anyways, so I don't know if this game storyline is more straightforward or not. Um, I I, I want to say it is, but I haven't gotten much at all of the storyline. I just know the base idea, which is basically what it just gave us. Six months have passed since you were accused. Wait, no voice acting for this, right? Yeah, no voice acting. Six months have passed since you were accused by the royal spymaster of murdering the empress and conspiring to abduct her daughter, Emily, the royal heir. Now, locked away in Coldridge Prison, the time of your execution draws near. But yeah, um, that's what I meant. So far, the story seems almost stupidly straightforward, which, like I said, I've not played far enough. I don't know if there's actually e ever gonna be a twist. People, d people bitch about Dark Messiah being a bit of a lame storyline, but I, I, I feel like Dark Messiah had enough twists and interest to keep me interested. But I mean, this guy, pretty much a guy who looks like a Nazi, is an evil guy, and the other guy is a douchebag too. Like everybody's a douchebag. That's, it, it, that's pretty much what it sounds like. Um. And the uh, thing is, they don't even keep it much of a secret. That's my main problem because for now. at least it's a at least it's a went in this direction where it's like you don't know if they're actually evil or if they just are stupid. Like right now, they play along as if like they don't know that you are the killer. Her daughter Emily is hidden away. Like, like it could be like yeah, it could be like they just misunderstood the whole situation, but. Without spoiling much, you pretty much very soon going to find out that they are douchebags. <laughs> yeah, that, that's kind of what I'm gathering, and I think I think this game's storyline is straightforward. Uh, I'm not going to say that's what it should be like, because this is the type of game that's perfect for plot twists, but um, I'm going to say that I'm okay with the occasional game with the straightforward storyline. Uh, there are a lot of games with straightforward storylines. Yeah, I don't mind. Now. Like I said, I don't but, mind. Um, it's not going to kill the game for me, but... I mean, there could be a not straightforward storyline, because, I mean, Steve manages yeah, yeah. to do this thing there. It seems really simple yeah. in storyline, and it just slaps you, it could slaps you right in the face. <laughs> yeah, that is true. That is possible. It's possible that everyone's just a douchebag, and then it'll bitch slap you. Oh, hey, this dude is just... Just a douchebag, but he's not evil. He's yeah, yeah, just... that, that's what I would have liked. If they, if that guy was not actually evil, just a douchebag, I would be like, it's nice. But I don't think it's gonna happen, at least not from what I've seen. Like, I've not actually played the game that far, but I've yeah. also seen other people play it. And so, up to the point I saw, which is like 80% of the game, I think it's the first of normal. What, so you've seen like 80% of the game? I've so not seen it. I, I've you? seen a point in the game where it's 80% into the game, but I've not seen 80% of the game. The reviewer guy was in chapter 7 of like 11 chapters and he okay, was still doing so we, the same we're, thing. So we gotta read this, yeah? Yes. Okay, um, let's take turn reading these. Uh, I'll read this one. Corvo, we are... Who we are is irrelevant. Right now, just know that we have faith in you. Here, have the key to your cell. Once you're out, head for the prison's interrogation room. Take the explosive there and plant it on the outer door when the bomb goes off. Run! Make for the river and lose yourself in the sewers. You'll find some useful gear stashed there. One of the prison guards will have a weapon just outside your cell. Good luck. We need you live for what's to come, a eh, friend. And I'm oh yeah, recording. by the way, huh? Oh. But yeah, I don't know that much of the game. I'm just saying I saw a point in the game later in the game, and it seemed like you were still doing the same thing you were doing for the yeah, first. That, that, that's, but that's 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 fine, I guess. So there uh, wasn't hey, a plot twist. So yeah, that. yeah, it, it's fine. Hey, to pair. Uh, so so far it doesn't sound like we have much of a choice, but. How do you plan on going about the whole, uh, killing th Like, do you plan on going through with killing a lot of people, or not that many? Well, this is... Sorry. 
But look at this. <laughs> okay, um. <laughs> this, this, this is. Yeah, this it's just that. physics is amazing. Oh, oh fuck. This. I'm going back in my cell. <laughs> do shit. I don't think he's gonna fall for that. You're totally <laughs> wielding his sword. Now the door is open. Uh. I, I was gonna say, I w I'm gonna go with it in this. I'm not. I'm gonna try to not kill people, but if I get if, spotted, I'm go I'm gonna play in a kind of like do not die way. Like I'm play I'm gonna try at least for as far as I can a realism kind of way where you just don't wanna die. Right. And you try right. not to so, kill people, but if you get spotted, you have to kill people because yeah, okay. you can't just I'm purposely fine, kill I'm yourself. Fine with that. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine with that. We're playing on very hard, so I actually prefer that over uh, just saying, "Hey, we're not gonna kill anyone." Because then if you get spotted by anyone, everything is just terrible. Uh, though you do have non-lethal stuff, which is nice. Like, just said non-lethal takedown sort of thing. Yes. No, most of the least that has way more ways. There's actually a lot of ways to kill people, which is ironic in this game. Yeah. It's like, you can not kill people, but we give you so much. But I'm actually gonna have to, um... This time I'm actually gonna have a safe time because I do not know the freaking controls of this game. Wow. Why? Why don't you know the controls of this game? I because thought I you played I, it for 35 minutes. I did, but it did. It's very forgettable controls just because there's too much to do, too many buttons. Oh, your face is 20 buttons. Not 20 buttons. I said too many buttons. Oh. 20 <laughs> buttons would also be too many buttons, but I see, that's it's not that many. Because it's hopefully. blocking. I keep forgetting which button is to take it down, uh, do a takedown, that's my main problem. I don't know uh, what button is takedown, so it tends to get me screwed over. Well, you can go ahead and... Left control, there it was. Because I thought I was doing that. Let's see if this works. Because I kind of want to speed up this. Right. Yeah. America, you totally knocked that guy out. Now, now I'm gonna leave yeah. him. Huh? Oh He's yeah, fine. yeah. Just, 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 just put him in your cell. Rape him so hard. No one will ever know. Hide, hide him in, in your, uh, in your non-existent mattress, and just no one will ever know that you're hiding the rape toy in there. What the? God damn it, one whatever. Fuck you. Just, we we don't care that you spotted us. Cause you got you can all die. Oh, there's that guy up there who's like there's a guy killing people. You already been spotted. Why are you hiding the bodies? Because I that's what I do. Alright, I guess. You know, I, it's actually fine. It doesn't look like they're actually sending more people like you think they would. And, and it is funny that they're just fine. Um, <sighs> that reminds me, if you ever do like go around and kill people and stuff, uh, if you're ever... Never mind, just like... I'll, if I ever want you to like throw someone off a building, I'll tell you. Look at this. This is that is amazing. <laughs> oh yeah. Look at those moves. Okay. I I'm I am so horny for Corvo right now. With those why am I not sweet surprised? ass moves. Huh? I'm why am I not surprised? I don't know. Why aren't you why Dude, are, why, you, why why are you not surprised? <laughs> You you tell me, I guess, even though I don't want you to. So much crap to loot. Yeah, loot I I, I love loot, so it's fine. It's fine. Loot everything. Loot all this oh they're like there is a dude here. Oh wait, this is terrible. Um It is. I'm terrible. Yeah. I'm I'm too I'm rushing this way too much right now. Yeah, I, I forgot that you have to look through the keyhole because if, if you don't look through the keyhole, the game gets very mad at you. Yeah, <laughs> it seems like that game where it's like through every other door, uh, and but obviously not literally every other, but through every other door there's 
Just guys. Right, it's because it wants to teach you to look through keyholes. Okay, actually, yeah. this is actually not that bad. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, they're they're back to like, oh hey, there's a dude, but dude, it's fine, I guess. We and don't play that me, but... much. Huh? Bring it, bro. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I imagine the AI is gonna be better when you're out of the intro, so they're probably. Uh, it's, uh, I guess there's not much I could do, I know. Yeah, because it's the it, because it's a tutorial, so they're literally programmed to not go past a certain point. Yeah. Wait, I, I, most AIs can't climb. <laughs> oh, those AIs are bad at this. But they actually they just disappeared, I think. <laughs> Yeah, no, well, yeah, I don't know, like, they didn't disappear, but they seem irrelevant now. Yeah, okay, I have to actually start playing this for CS now. Okay. Because this is ridiculous right now. Yeah, you are, you are very hard. I guess it makes sense that you'd have to play it seriously. Okay. It's super... Okay, this is what I meant. This is where the game pretty much is like, these guys are evil as fuck. This is yeah. what they can always take in more punishment. Yeah. All this, all this bullshit. So, okay, there's a guy talking. Uh, I, I, I see what you mean. You don't have to get very far in the game for it to be like, hey, these guys are douchebags. Admittedly, though this game's a game about stealth, and I wouldn't have minded a plot twist or two, um, I, I kind of don't mind the whole revenge quest thing. So I'm like, I guess it's fine that, you know, it, it's straightforward. There, 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 there are that many games that I, I'm like, this game just straight up shouldn't have had a straightforward. Once the child shows the proper inclination, he's marked. Overseers are assigned to study the subject, seal whatever the word is, in order to determine whether this inclination is supported by cosmological conditions and other signs on going through the year. At the end of the cycle, those befitting further testing are removed from their homes some hours before dawn and must begin to march to an outpost outside the city. There, the children undergo a ritual preparation and evaluation until the last night of the months of rain when they make a pilgrimage to White Cliff. During an elaborate ceremony, it is determined which of the children become over. See us in which we must be put down. Wow, what these guys are douchebags! <laughs> I, I think those uh, are not actually the bad guys. <laughs> huh? Those are actually not the bad guys, I think. Well, I don't <laughs> care, they're still douchebags and you should kill all of them. I ch I, I, I'm. I seem to like to take the violent solution in these games, but I'm just like, wow, you're be that those is a high guys move. are douchebags. Huh? That's a high roof. That is the fucking high roof. Also, your guy can throw shit really far. <laughs> I know. Um, but, anyways. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> America just breaking <laughs> these bottles on your, on your face. <laughs> okay. This, this, is, on. this is how Koro does shit. Duty officers report Koro, Koro's interrogation. Koro Atano, firmly the royal protector will be brought in for interrogation. This is of utmost important importance. The Lord Regent and High Overseer Campbell will conduct the questioning themselves, following follow their orders without hesitation and keep the torture under control. If Corvo dies in his hands instead of getting the public execution, the Lord Regent warns it be your head that was next. Okay. That's that's nice, douchebags. Okay. <laughs> These guys are really bad. Is this is actually the part last time that I managed to sneak through without killing anyone. So yeah, let's hope we pull this off. Because yeah. I, I don't want to kill too many people at the beginning in the game. Yeah, I hear it like changes the ending or something. It changes pretty much everything, I know. This is a low or high chaos rating. Last time I did get a low rating. Oh, fuck. Okay. Okay, let's just, just kill me this one time because, god, fuck you. <laughs> hey, because because you really don't want to just literally start the game off with killing everyone. <laughs> uh, I guess that is a bad way to 
Why are you on the graphics? Because oh, the game is too good. Like 